History continues to fly into the Wabash Valley this week, and it's all leading up to the Terre Haute Air Show. News Sarah Lehman took flight through history in a C-47 used in World War II today. That is cool. She joins us now live from the Terre Haute Regional Airport. So, Sarah, have to ask you, how was that flight? Rondrell, it was very cool. It was the ride of a lifetime. And like you said, it was a plain C-47. It's actually the one here right behind me. I'm going to take a step back just so you can take all of this in. And as you maybe can hear, they're getting ready to start the engines. Um, this plane went through one, at least 100 missions during World War II. Now the family, the Brown family who owns the piece of history, says they're a really big aviation family. Actually, their sons just took off in a plane and now they're in this plane. A group of them are flying to Indianapolis to have dinner. They're all going in their planes. And so it's a really big family affair. It was 1936 and luxury planes were just starting to fill production lines. They were quickly turned into war planes when World War II started. One of those planes is right in our own backyard. I'm off the factory assembly line on June 2nd, 1944 was then six days later transferred to the Canadian government on June 8th. Uh, and then from right from then, right into combat in uh, June 13th, it landed in Europe. Missed D-Day by just about a week. This is what it looked like when the Browns bought the plane about a year ago. Now it looks almost like it did during the war, inside and out. We, we spent about a little bit over a year with the restoration and it's still got a lot of work to do, but aesthetically it's uh, it's come a long way. The whole family is involved in the project. During our ride, they told us all the things that had to be restored. Both of their sons helped, even in the extreme heat. As always, aviation is a passion for our entire family. Our boys are hev as heavily involved in it as we are. I think we always had the one day dream that this would maybe happen. Flying over the city today in their plane, I think it's still surreal, don't you? Yeah, it's a, it's a great feeling. It's a, it's a grand old lady to fly. Now, this is just one of the planes that you're going to be seeing at the Terre Haute Air Show, and they're getting ready to take off right now. Wow, I just got hit with a lot of wind from that plane. Um, but tickets to the Terre Haute Air Show and also tickets to personally ride in this plane are still available. You can find more information at WTHITV.com. For now, live at the Terre Haute Regional Airport, Sarah Lehman, News 10, back to you.